Entering service in 2008, the bow is deemed to be multi-purpose as it aims to protect the coast, straits, as well as naval bases. It takes about 30 to 40 minutes to reload the missile system once it is fired, its range is 120 kilometers, and the complex has the capacity to fire both single missiles as well as volleys of up to 32 subsonic missiles. The complex also has night vision amongst its arsenal of modern devices. However, debatably its most useful feature is its mobility and short deployment time of only 10 minutes. According to military expert, Viktor Murakovsky, the BAL missile defense system's purpose is exactly what its name implies, to defend. According to the Russian Defense Ministry, the first BAL systems are already in place, like on Franz Josef land in the northern Barents Sea. Shortly, the complexes are going to be dotted alongside the entire northern sea route. The BAL system's increased deployment follows a statement from last December by Defense Ministry, Sergei Shoigu. He claimed that the number of BAL and Bastion systems of the armed forces at the time had only reached 74% of what is needed. He also said infrastructure is developing in the Arctic region. As seen now, his two claims foreshadowed the now-announced increase of BAL systems in the Arctic, is Vestia reported. Russia has no intention of using the missile system in international waters, Murakovsky said to his bestia. Deployed along the northern sea route, the aim is to protect Russia's own territorial waters from any dangers or threats, he underlined. Murakovsky said no one will be able to enter Russia's Arctic waters without difficult hindrance. Exceptions can be made for civil vessels adhering to appropriate rules, which can in specific cases enable them to pass the territorial waters. However, warships will be strictly prohibited, especially in the case of military conflicts or escalations. Availability of active and passive radars detection channels ensures flexible strategy of designation data generation. High maneuverability and covert change of a fire position are ensured by the platform with great cross-country capabilities. Ammunition load is transported by the transport loading vehicles so that another missile salvo can be launched within a minimum interval. Bali provides reliable defense of the state's coastline and maritime platforms from the sea attacks. The missile system can conduct combat actions, providing fully autonomous after-launch missile guidance in fair and adverse weather conditions, by day and night, under enemy fire and electronic countermeasures. The Bali is a mobile weapon system, based on the Mas 7930 chassis up to two self-propelled command, control and communications posts. Up to four self-propelled launchers with the KH-35UE type anti-ship missiles in transport launch containers, eight TLCs on a standard launcher. Up to four transport reload vehicles intended for preparing the next salvo. The C-3 post provides target reconnaissance, designation and optimal distribution between launchers. Active and passive high-precision radar channels allow the system to implement flexible target acquisition strategies, including covert ones. The launchers and transport reload vehicles can be deployed in covered positions in the depth beyond the coastline. In this case neither covertness of their combat positions nor man-made and natural obstacles in the direction of fire will limit combat employment of the system. 
The system can conduct both single and salvo fire from any launcher, with the capability of receiving current information from other command posts and external reconnaissance target designation data sources. A salvo can include up to 32 missiles. One such salvo can thwart a combat mission carried out by an enemy naval attack group, a landing force or a convoy. The system can fire the next salvo in 30 to 40 minutes, thanks to its transport reload vehicles. Combat management of the Bally assets is based on digital data transmission, automated communications, message processing and ciphering with guaranteed security. The system is equipped with night vision, navigation, survey and positioning aids, enabling it to rapidly change its firing positions after completing the assigned mission and relocate to a new combat area. The system can be deployed in the new position within 10 minutes. An integrated coastal defense system combining the Bally CMS, offshore patrol vessels with the Uranee ship-borne missile systems and missile-carrying combat aircraft, armed with the KH-35UE Unified Anti-Ship Missiles, would be able to perform diverse operational and tactical tasks at minimal costs thanks to a single missile maintenance and repair system. The system's structure and exact number of the C-3 posts, launch and transport reload vehicles, are defined according to customer requirements. The Mas 7930 self-propelled chassis can be replaced with other types of chassis, it can be proposed for the light configuration Bally CMS, with enhanced agility and off-road capacity. The Bally CMS has a considerable potential for upgrading. Employment of additional target designation assets, such as radar picket helicopters or remotely piloted aerial vehicles, allows the system to increase its target detection range and precision. The Bally CMS can be equipped with passive interference systems to considerably enhance its invulnerability to enemy-guided weapons in dueling situations. Other upgrading options are also considered.